Good day folks, Sean here from Air Photography. So yesterday we got a really interesting firmware update for the DJI Neo 2 that allows us now to control it with our Apple Watch. Now according to the release notes of the DJI Fly app, this new feature allows you to control your original Neo and the DJI Flip as well. In order to utilize this new feature, you will need to update the firmware on your DJI Neo 2 and make sure you download the latest update for the DJI Fly app. So I'll just demonstrate quickly here how it works. Before we can use it, we do have to connect the Neo 2 to our smartphone. You can't connect your watch directly to the Neo 2. You do have to use your smartphone as well. So I've launched the Fly app and we're now connected. Then if I go over to my Apple Watch, we'll scroll until we find the Fly app here. We'll tap on it and it should go ahead and connect. And as you can see, we now have a visual preview, which is pretty handy. So if you're on a bike or just out doing some hiking, you can put your phone away in your pocket or in a camera bag and you'll be able to get a visual preview right on your watch. Now we can't launch the drone directly from our Apple Watch, but we can give it voice commands, which I'll demonstrate here in a minute. But what we can do, if we tap the bottom there, that's going to bring up all the different modes that we can select. So right now I'm in spotlight mode, but I can switch it to selfie shot, skiing follow. So we can go through all the different modes directly from our Apple Watch, which again is handy. We don't have to pull our phone out of our pocket in order to change modes. And on top of that, we can also change some of the attributes. For example, if we select boomerang there, we tap on the attributes there at the bottom. We can set the distance. If we go to cycling follow, again, we can set some of the distance, the follow direction, follow distance, and the follow height. So pretty handy. And on top of that, we can also give it voice commands just like we do on our smartphone. So we can say, hey, fly. Go ahead. So you can see it's now listening for a command. Now I'm just gonna move the drone here because I can't launch it right where it is. Hey, fly. Go ahead. Spotlight. Three, spotlight, two, one. So as you can see, that actually works quite well. So this is going to be a handy feature just to be able to change some quick settings on the fly. If you have the Neo 2 connected to your smartphone, you can put your phone away. You don't have to pull it out to change settings. We can easily adjust things right on the Apple Watch. We can switch our modes, switch some of the attributes, give it voice commands. And as mentioned earlier on, this works with the original Neo and with the DJI Flip. So if you own any of these drones, just make sure you update the firmware, make sure you update the Fly app. So yeah, folks, just a quick firmware update going over the new Apple Watch feature of the DJI Neo 2. Hopefully you enjoyed this video and found it had value. Thanks a lot for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.